Shalom Makim, this brother Kamal Mahar here, back at it again. First thing first, I'm going to give all praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, and Kakwadash. Double honor to the apostles and elders, learners, true from, from GMS. Blessings to Akimah Dare, preaching his word, with whole our true sincerity. Uh, blessings to the 144,000 and one third entirely. Lord willing, and one of those men. Uh, uh, the house of David, the Biaf, Dawah, Dah. Shalom to you, brothers out there, speaking in different tongues and looking in different nations. Shalom. So, you know, I know you guys are, uh, you fellas. Um, are familiar with Dabu 7, uh, Dabu 7, 7. Um, I like following this brother. Uh, you know, it's not a brother, but I like following this guy. And, you know, it could be Israelite, who knows. Uh, but I like following this page because, uh, you know, it's always um, really, you know, it's always really good to hear, you know, um, uh, you know, uh, fear monger when it comes to Babylon. You know what I'm saying? It's always something to look forward to. Um, you know, the, the, these channels are really good to be on your watchtower. And, um, you know, I love what they talk about. This is it says uh, cash is about to vanish, which, uh, you know, us Israelites on the highways and hedges and doing these videos. We always talk about how, you know, uh, one of the key chaos moves and also, um, you know, uh, one of the moves led to that microchip market of the beast um, is going to be the crash of the dollar and a whole new digital currency system that's coming very, very fast. So this is this is basically just land backing on what we've been saying, along with you know a lot of brothers follow politics and follow you know a lot of um, what you would call alternative media television, um, which is that's that's also a, a a channel to follow too with the um, Bitcoin boy. I know brothers um, uh, Christopher Green, I think his name is, um, but yeah, uh, uh, you know through the spirit, you know, like my brother Gabar would say, I'm gonna say this as a man. These alternative media uh, channels are are legit. Um, I will I will say you know for uh, you know as a man, I will say uh, 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 the things that they're saying and these and these vainly prophesied prophecies that they're talking about, which is according to prophecy and a lot of different things, uh, but they also are speaking truth. I, I would say you know RT News is 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 legit and these. You know, backdoor double seven seven AM TV type of you know uh, uh, channels are legit as far as like what's up the up and coming. Um, so I will highly recommend brothers you know follow these. Uh, this one is um I guess it's, I guess it's saying the claim they claim virus stays on banknotes for four weeks and uses plunges right. So and that's pretty um that's exactly what Esau's going to do. That's what they do to to bring in their agenda. You know, they always got to, you know, bring something to the fold to, you know, to, you know, say something or, or, or make a situation to cause chaos to to be able to, you know, go forward with their agenda on what they plan on, you know, on, on the upper elites. You know, the idea is obviously to bring in this chip is obviously, uh, you know, digital currencies on the scene. You know, they already took the, um, you know, what you call the, the coins are already being uh, taken away from stores. This is all, suck it, brothers. It's all part of the plan to bring in this this new agenda, man. It's RFID chip market of beasts on the scene, and so this is a good way to you know pretty much continue the so called fear of the coronavirus by saying that the coronavirus is now on the cash money. So now it's saying that that the coronavirus can stay on paper, um, for days and days at a time. You know what? Um, in Philadelphia. There's a, a famous uh, 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 um, radio channel called Power 99 FM, and also that that was also on Power 99 Power 99 FM, and also 103.9 as a as a radar alert um, that the coronavirus can stay on paper as well to increase the fear of the virus to 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 to, to you know to contribute to the uh, make people not want to deal with cash anymore. You know, that's what Esau is doing in order to, you know, to move their agenda. So, you know, I got I wanted to play this video. Um, I'm gonna let it play out. It's three minutes. Um uh take a look at what Dabu 77 is saying, which a lot of us a lot of us brothers already know, but it's very interesting to see how fast this is kicking up. Hey guys, Dabu 7, a very important video here. Things are changing rapidly out there. And what we have now is some well-timed releases of information through the mainstream. Now, we've got to look at this for what it is. First off, this is something we've warned about for years. 
I initially dropped the Beast blockchain video back in 2017, warning where this was going to go when this got on blockchain. You won't be able to hide your money under your mattress in a safe. You won't be able to hide it at all. They will know every move. So all of a sudden, throughout everything we've been living through in 2020, they started to take back the coins. They never made no huge announcements saying why. But they said, we're going to take back the coins. It's what started happening everywhere, and they're not giving them back at all. Also, your normal penny right now is worth way more than the one cent value on the market than what it's being used for. Not to mention, silver is starting to tick up, and it's going to explode. And when it does, all this currency, all these metals that are floating around out there across the country, copper and silver, they're going to be worth something. And people will be cashing them in to get the value out of it. Well, guess what? Your government's one step ahead of you. They're just going ahead and taking it beforehand before they say anything about it. This is huge. And what we said when they started taking back the coin is that you wait till the fiat goes. They're taking, taking your coinage now and not giving it back. You just wait till the fiat comes. And everyone's always been talking about the death of the dollar, and rightfully so. Trying to get a bead on what's going to happen. But what we're seeing here is about to be the death of fiat. Do you understand this? Let this sink in. Not just the U.S. dollar. You're talking fiat currency globally is about to get wiped out. See, the fiat currency globally. So, you know, you know, brothers don't know. A lot of us, you know, I don't want to salt in the brothers' intelligence, but for the edification's sake, you know, fiat currency is what you see on the screen. It's the paper money that, you know, that's across the world that has their different ones. You know, you got, you know, the euro, which is he look at you looking at right now, the American American dollar between, you know, what our American money is, uh, you know, the one to the five to the 10 to the 50 and the 100. And then, you know, and in, in the same concept all over the world between country to country that has paper money, that's fiat. It's about to be destroyed all across, all across the, uh, the world. Now, granted, we've been already talking about, you know, after fiat currency comes in, you know, it's going to be digital currency. That's why you got Bitcoin, Lithium, uh, Ethereum, uh, Litecoin, all those different currencies. Um, that That's on a blockchain aspect. You know, the uh, America's already a step ahead on their currency called the, uh, the digital dollar, which will be so-called American money. And it's going to be all digital. And then you see how they already, you know, saying that the, the coronavirus is, is now located on, on paper now, uh, which is contributing to, to spreading the virus itself. It's all unrighteous decrees and smooth butter, you know, things that Esau say, which I'm going to get to some scriptures uh, to back that up. Um, but you can see how they're cleverly, you know, transitioning the situation between the killer of fiat and what's, what's the only thing left. It will be digital currency. And we already have the five G's all the way around to control this the system, just the whole system in being in place right now. This is a huge move. Huge. And they're not saying a word about it? Of course not. The way that they're playing this is so slick and so smooth. All the lemmings out there in society aren't even asking any questions. It's like boiling the frog. It's happening in such slow motion that it's working. To their advantage, and the people don't even realize what's going on. Right, Esau, Esau got Esau got everybody in the trick bag. But the, but the water Yahab Bashim Yahushah that you know that the, the Lord had you know you know gave us the blessings of the mysteries of these prophecies to see these this stuff happening before it happened. I mean, we're literally as Israelites, the water Yahab Bashim Yahushah, you know, for for uh you know you know Second Corinthians two and eleven. I'm gonna bring it out. You know, let Satan get advantage advantage of us that we are not ignorant of Satan's devices. That's very true. Like we're literally, it's as if we're in a boardroom with the elites, man, looking over their 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 plans right alongside of them. I mean, we're it's it's as if it's the same, and that's through the pair the, the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. That's 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 beautiful. We literally know all their tricks and all their stumbling blocks, and we know all their their moves. It's crazy, but it's a beautiful thing. So, not only is this about to happen in mass, they're saying that the use case for cash is plunging. And that's all they got to do is control the narrative, control the headlines and say this and that, and they'll push it. And the lemmings will accept it. Right. I just found out um, not too long ago, probably a couple days ago, 
where, uh, you know, matter of fact, Apostle Gabar put it up. Apostle Gabar just put up a video on, um, this is a, this is a great land back from Apostle Gabar's video on that little interview between those two men. I forgot who they were. Uh, brothers can check out Apostle Gabar's, uh, uh, crash of a dollar video recently. Um, but it, but the main point was, according to what Dabu 77 is saying, uh, Apostle Gabar's video was saying how the Edomite was saying that 97% of the purchasing power of the dollar is gone. 97% of the purchasing power. So, you know, and then now this is where Dabu Dabu77 is saying where um the you know the 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 uh the dollar is, is becoming you know at naught. It's just nothing. You see what I'm saying? So it, it, it was going hand in hand. You know, this is this is really happening, you know, right under uh you know two thirds of our people and all the heathens uh knows. I mean it's literally walking right in front of them, man. This is crazy. So your biggest enemy is all the lemmings around you accepting what the totalitarians are enforcing on us all. You realize that, don't you? This is why we fought this fight all these years to wake as many people up as possible. Because that's where it's at. The power is in your numbers. The power is in the people and the politics that they address. So a heads up here for what's happening in slow motion right now. And I would prepare. I would hedge your bets, and I would get ready for a huge transition. It would be the biggest of our lifetimes. And the removal of this fiat, like I said, is going to be global. Make sure to join me over on DLive, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. See, Esau, Esau, got, yo, Esau got this world in a trick bag. Yo, they are clever. Just like you said, you know, with, uh, you know in Genesis, man. Genesis, what, 3? I believe it was, I can get to it where it said that, uh, that the serpent was subtle, you know, cunning, which is very intelligent, very crafty. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's, you know, that's what it is, man. I, I wanted to get in a couple of precepts. First things first, you know, Esau got everybody in a trick bag, but not the, you know, not the Israelites, man. That's, that's a woke to this thing. You know, this is, uh, second Corinthians, uh, believe two and 11. It says, lest Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. We're not, man. And that's the water Yahab Hashem Yabashav, so we're revealing the secrets, man. We 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 definitely um we definitely know what's going on. Um, you know, uh, you know, in the society we live in, man, the Lord is making sure is protecting his men and making sure we are ahead of the game. So that way, just like Dabu Seven Seven is, we you know we're, we're trying to, we're, you know, we in this thing to, to seal the elect, man. You know that's what we in this thing for, to seal the elect. So that way, you know, we can get up out of here. You know, we not worried about two thirds of our people. We not, you know, all that have love for everybody. You know, that's not in the time we in right now. We're not in the time to be saving two thirds or none of that. No having love. You know what I mean? No, no, listen, you know, you know, we're gonna show love to our people as far as you know, out on the street as we walking about. But we in this ministry, man, we in this thing for the elect, man. We in this thing for the elect. So, you know, Amos three and seven, surely the Lord Yahweh will do nothing but he revealeth his secret unto his servants, the prophets. Right. And so it's our job to get to speak to the masses. Yeah. We're gonna we gonna tell our people what it is, you know, because we know our we, our people are stiff neck. But at the end of the day, though, we're going to tell our people that, look, the crash of the dollar is coming. It's part of prophecy. It's going to cause chaos. And they're going to usher in the mark of the beast, RFID chip. You do not do not take it. And then we bring out why and why not. That's just what it is, man. Yo, this dollar is going to crash, man. And all our people are rapping about this fiat currency. They glorify in the fiat currency. They got money on, you know, at like phones, man. Yo, our people are really in the trick bag. And when that money comes to nothing, man, yo, that's how the chaos going to hit. I, I, as a man, I'm looking at that. This drop of the dollar is going to start the, the transition of the system where Esau going to come in like a flood. As soon as that, as soon as that chaos spark out and, and Jake and two thirds, two thirds of our people, so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Indians going to lose their mind. It's going to be hell out here in these streets, man. And just like what's that? Uh, the, the the Great Depression of um, um uh, uh, nineteen uh was nineteen ten, nineteen twenty nine, nineteen twenty nine. You know, if you do your research and look at those times, you know they had fiat currency like a strip club out here, man. It was just money all over the floor, all over the ground. They were using the paper to burn fires, and it was really about nothing. 
yo, there's nothing new under the sun that's going to happen the same way again. And so we are, we are on our watchtower to tell our people, man, yo, you got to repent and you got to come back to the law, statute, commandments of the Lord because this chaos is going to is going to come down. And it's all going to be on money. This whole money thing is going to be a big, major factor of this transition. Oh, man. Woo-wee. It's not going to be none of that storing up, you know, gold and silver. That ain't really going to go down. Um, Zephaniah. Uh, one in 18, you know, cause money going to be, money is going to be a thing, man, but it's really not. Thus saith the Lord it says, it says, uh, oh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and uh, read 17 and 18 and I will bring distress upon men, right? The Lord will bring, bring stress upon men because that love of money, man, that love of money, which is it is it, which money is a defense. It is, that's, but that's all it is, though. But it's not something you want to glorify and and think you better than anybody. From no, that's not the way it works, man. These scriptures is what you is what makes you better than somebody. If you want to look at it through the spirit, you're better than somebody by having these scriptures. That's just really what it is. Having the knowledge and the wisdom of these scriptures, I'm gonna say as a man, makes you better than somebody. It really does. You know, if you don't have this truth. Then you really nothing for real because this whole thing is on salvation, man. We trying to get delivered out here. So yes, you know, not speaking from pride, but if you look at it through the spirit, I'm gonna say it again. You are technically a better person than somebody else by having his wisdom and knowledge and understanding and being able to apply it and being able to go through your life and have faith in the Lord. Yes, you're a you're better than someone else. I'm gonna say it like that, and I will bring stress upon the men, right? Because that's coming. Cause you know distress, oh, oh man, when these when this money crash, man, the the distress upon men is gonna be vicious. That they shall walk like blind men. They not gonna know what to do. That nobody's gonna know what they're they gonna be pulling their hair. Oh my gosh, my four hundred one k, my 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 you know your so called uh pensions, you know your fifteen to thirty five dollar an hour job. Listen, look if you if you don't if you don't transition to that. To that RFID chip in this new system, you're not going to survive out here unless you got Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. That's the only way it's going to work. I'm, I'm reading Zephaniah 1 and 17. It says that I will bring distress upon distress upon men that they shall walk in bl like blind men because they have sinned against the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Right. You know, sin across the board and also, you know, the love of this money rather than Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. And their blood shall be poured out as dust, and their flesh as the dung. You know what I'm saying? You got the race wars. It's gonna be, it's gonna be dying with that. It's gonna be death upon all different sides, along with them ICP and missiles, man, them chariots. And it said, here we go. Here goes the major point. Uh, 18. Neither their silver nor their gold shall be shall be able to deliver them in that day of the Lord's wrath. Right. But the whole land shall be devoured by the fire of his jealousy, for he shall make even a speedy riddance of all them that dwell in the land. Right. This money ain't going to be about nothing. And it's, an, it's, it's about to not be nothing too. Especially to, to, the, to, the, Israel, to, the, to the brothers out there, the hopeful elect. It's really, it's, see, money ain't nothing to us now. We need it. But it's really not going to be nothing in them days because our real currency is going to be the faith in the Lord because we're not getting no chip and we're not getting no vaccine. So brothers going to be pilgrims immediately. We're about to be pilgrims like right now. Through the spirit, we're about to be pilgrims like right now. Now what are we going to do? You know, the, but, but, but have faith in the Yahweh Yahusha to, to deliver us, man. We, we, we still got to eat. The Lord said you're going to handle that. We got we to gotta, we gotta be protected. The Lord said you're going to handle that. You know, however it's going to happen, the Lord said he's going to handle that. So we got to just move according to that great faith. That's why we've been in the scriptures for so long and we've been, you know, building our brain up. And that's why I said, Isaiah 33 and 6, that wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times. Right. Because having this knowledge in those rough ass times, you're going to remember what the Lord said, what to do, pray, move, just keep moving. The Lord got you. That's stability. While everybody running around losing their damn mind, we're going to be sitting there like, calm down, relax. You know what the Lord said. That's, that's literally what we're doing. This is a mental prepare, man. <laughs> this is crazy, man. And and look, and now they're talking about, you know, oh, oh, the coronavirus is now on, uh, you know, uh, 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 on the paper, so they can bring in their new, their new, their new system. You know that, that you know that's Richard's got by deceit right there. And and look, 
And look, they said the coin shortages has already started, which we see it. Why is that what Dabu77 also said? They already up ahead of the game taking the coins because they know it's going to be worth some. Because these coins are copper and these coins are silver. That is pretty much true. So think about copper for real for real on a one cent coin is actually way more than one cent if you think about it. That's, that's Think about it. Because... I, you know, I, as a as a demolition worker for a while, you know, I I take copper and 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 and, and turn it in for you know, shoot, three to four dollars per panel maybe. So imagine a bunch of coins which adds up really quickly. You know, you put what, a hundred a hundred fifty pennies in one bag. That's a lot of weight. So these coin shortages are already being, these coins are already being taken because the government and the elites already know what they're about. See, we look at it as one cent, but for in reality, one, one penny is actually worth way more than that. So they're pulling them now. That's intelligent. Uh, what's that? Um, uh, Ciroc. Uh, ten. Right, Ciroc 10 and 8. Because of unrighteous dealings, and injuries and riches got by deceit. The kingdom is translated from one people to another. And that's coming. You know, it says unrighteous dealings. That's unrighteous what they're doing right now, man. They're pulling the coins, not letting the people know the transition, you know, and they already got an evil agenda already going on. And they're going to destroy that fiat currency, which a lot of people, which is which is bullshit. But at the end of the day, they'll look at it for what it is. They already they already got this thing set up where people got 401ks. They already set them up with credit. Esau set them up with all these loans and different things of that nature just to just to strip it from them for their own, you know, gain. You know, like like the elites is already buying like, you know, uh, 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 Goldman Sachs and all I'm talking about. They already dumping fiat and, 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 and treasuries of, of American money. And they're already buying the, the, the digital currencies and, uh, you know, the Bitcoins and digital currencies. And they already buying those up because it's a transition of power. So they, they, the wealth is, wealth is being transferred, but they're not letting the people, you know, know. They already spending in Bitcoin and different currencies while we still spending in cash money, thinking that this thing's going to keep on going. See, that's riches got by deceit right there. And 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 I, I can even bring out Isaiah 10 and 1 because, you know, because, you know, it says, uh, woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees and write grievous grievousness, which they which they have prescribed. Right. See, these they they, 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 they making decrees, but then again, they not really warning the people, that, you know, only a certain amount of people got what's going on. Esau, man. Man, look, boy. And 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 our and our people who rich right now, man, they think they think this money, they think this money is is, is what it is, man. It's really not, man. I'm going to James James five and one. It says, uh, "Go go to now, you rich men, weep and howl for your miseries that shall come upon you." Right, yo yo man, yo yo these mi yo miseries of of especially our people thinking that this money going to be something, man. They glorified it. They about to be weeping and hollering when this when this money go to naught, man. Your riches are corrupted and your garments are moth eaten. Now it's really getting to Esau, but our people corrupted too with this money, man. Yo, they are yo, man. Yo. Boy. Our people are in a trick bag, man, with this riches. And even Esau are rich that don't even know about some of this stuff, man. Three, it says your gold and silver is cankered, and the rest of them shall be a witness unto, against you, and shall eat your flesh as it were with fire. You have heaped treasure together for the last days, right? That's Zephaniah 1 and 18, your gold and silver is not going to deliver you in the day of the wrath, man, of the Lord. It's not. Behold, the hire of the laborers who have reaped down your fields, which is of you kept back by fraud. Yo, yo, the scriptures is prophesying these of these times right now. You see what they doing. Yo, James 5 and 4, it says, behold, the hire of the laborers who have reaped down your fields, which is which is of you kept back by fraud. Cry of and the cries of them which have reaped are enter into the ears of the Lord of Sabaoth. Listen, yo, yo, listen, yo, you. This is a this is literally a trick bag that the Lord is just telling the people how they moving. Dabu seven seven is saying nothing but, but, but what, but James five and four is talking about right now. Yo, this is literally what's popping off right now, man. And, you know, throughout the Yahabashim Yahushua, that we have these scriptures that we know how to move, man. We don't put our trust 
We don't put our trust and our heart and soul into no damn riches. We put this thing in Yahweh Bashem Yahweh man. We only use the money. We don't need the money. Well, no, Salaki, we do need the money for our, you know, our, you know, our daily bread and to buy things and things of that nature. But through the spirit, we don't need money. We need the scriptures, man, the wisdom and knowledge. This is the real currency. And the Lord is going to add uh, all these things unto you. You see what I'm saying? The Lord said he knows what we need. Man, yo, the trick bag is here, brothers. Yo, this thing is getting real. Yo, I'm telling you, I'm I'm a I'm a agree with the elites and what the news is talking about as far as like these alternative media news. Yo, that election, that election is literally gonna be. I'm 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 brothers, I'm seeing it, man. This damn election is gonna be something. Um, you know, something big on this election. Um, and Esau is just a fucking piece of shit. I'm gonna go to um. And, and it say it say nothing, this say nothing. Um, you know, surprising. Esau's built like this, man. What's this? Isaiah fifty five? No, fifty eight. Fifty eight and three. Look, come on. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they as soon as they born. Speaking lies. Their poison is like the poison of a serpent. They are like the deaf adder that step of stop of her ear. Come on, man, which would not hearken to the voice of charmers, charming never so wisely. Come on, man, that's what we, that's what we seeing all day, every day, man. Look, man, come on, man. Esau ain't shit. They profane, and they they, 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 they speak, they, they, yo, they, they're built on speaking lies. The decrees are bullshit, and they tell, they say they're Jews, and they're not. They, they tell you they, they got your best heart and interest, and they don't. Come on, man. So, I brought this out. This was, this was, uh edifying to you brothers man this currency is gone brothers we can see this thing i just wanted to you know you know you know uh uh you know uh uh war uh, forewarn the brothers if you didn't get that you know i'm just trying to you know edify the brothers and so the elect and just you know be on the watchtower as we should brothers you'll keep doing this work brothers man we'll give all praise to yahweh by shim yahweh yahweh he is to be exists by shim in the name and the only begotten son the lord and savior yahweh shah by shim in the name and, uh, and the Holy Spirit of Rakak with Dash. Double iron to the apostles and elders on this truth from GMS. Blessing to you, my dear, preaching his word with whole our true sincerity. Blessing to the 144,000 and one third, and one third entirely, Lord willing, and one of those men. And uh, the house of David, the Biaf Dawada. And Shalom to you, brothers out there speaking different tongues and looking different nations. Shalom, brothers. Hold on, man. We almost out of here, man. We almost out of here.